Hi, and friends. Welcome to a gab, which is an unboxing. I don't typically do unboxings. I wanted to do this one because this item is a little bit special. I mean, all items are a little bit special, but um, this one is a little bit of a unique experience for me. It's my first time doing it. So I just wanted to share with you my first impressions and let's uh, open the box together. Okay, so it is a luxury item and I ordered it from DSW. So it's a YouTuber slash Instagrammer recently made a purchase and informed us all that DSW carries um, a specific brand that I actually happen to love and uh, he'd purchased something from them. And that's how I was able to get these. So a little gabby, but uh, I guess that's what we're doing here is gabbing. So um, if you are on Instagram and you're one of my Insta friends, then you probably know what I'm talking about. But if you don't, I won't give any more clues. Let's just get right. Uh, two flaps open. Ta-da. You guys, it's Gucci from DSW. Are you aware of this? Did you know? Are you one of the people who like got the inside track about that so let's see what comes in the box first um nothing special order summary and then information for returning it i suppose if i want to which is always a possibility when you order online so that should come with it all right so this is why i hate unboxings by the way what a struggle all right so let's move this out of the way and then We'll face this this way. Let's check it out together. Nice classic Gucci box. I don't know if it's classic. I think this is anyway kind of newer design for them. Um, and this is them. came in the box so we've got the Gucci care cards nice uh, some random paper all right and not one but two dust bags which is what I would expect and uh, that's pretty much it so that's what is in the bag in the box so wow um, this is pretty close to what comes in boxes when I purchase from Gucci. So these are called the Gucci Fria loafers and they are actually from the men's section. So I had to check the website a couple of times to find these. They said that they were updating the website daily. Um, when I first went to check the sales, I didn't see anything that I had to have. And I'm really just not in a place where I'm buying stuff to buy stuff just because it was a good deal. Like the prices were decent, but they weren't free. You know what I mean? So I didn't see anything that I was like have to have. So I wasn't checking for it, but I went to check the website maybe twice a day, you know, in the morning and around lunchtime just to see if they had updated. And eventually uh, these showed up and they were in the men's sections. I scoured the internet, did the conversions, and I'm hoping, really, really, really hoping that they fit me well. But this is what it is. So what was the experience like shopping on the DSW website for Gucci? Um, like I said, they first didn't have stuff that I had been looking for. Cute stuff, but just not stuff that I needed. They had like a couple of loafers, but they were in patterns that didn't really vibe with me. Um, they had a couple of sandals, a couple of the sneakers. I think that the Trek sneakers, you know what I mean? They had those and that, but I wasn't looking for that. So it did take me a couple of days to land on this, but I was persistent and there was no guarantee that they would have anything from one day to the next. So I, I think I really lucked out. Um, the shipping was free, but these took over 10 days to get to me. Over 10 days. I've ordered stuff from Japan and China that arrived overnight, almost. So that's kind of a long time. I think these ship from Ohio, so I don't know what took so long. Um, you could have paid for overnight shipping for a couple of extra dollars, like more than $10. And um, I didn't think I really wanted to invest in that way, so I didn't, but, um, I still think that's kind of a long time, but anyway, that's, uh, that's the one drawback I would say is that they did take quite a while to arrive, so I wouldn't order these 
uh, or Gucci from them or from DSW maybe at all if you're pressed for the thing. Okay, so what were the savings like? Your dollars, I believe, and they were going on the website for $3.99. Um, they had a special code off of Gucci that was like 5%, so I did use that, which basically saved me the tax on the purchase so that was pretty good so i ended up spending uh 392 dollars on these uh not bad not bad uh if they fit so the next test will be to see if they fit i intend to use these as pretty comfy shoes for lounging around and working from home so i am going to now give them a try see how they go and i'm not married to the idea of keeping these like at all so if they even a little bit don't fit well or don't feel good i'm getting a little bit of a heavy vibe from them if they're too heavy for me to be walking around the house then back they go so that's just uh how that cookie's gonna crumble but i'm optimistic and i hope that they will work because i just think they are adorable and these had been on my radar when they first came out i like them in the beige and brown that they were doing too um, but that wasn't available on the website and honestly i think beige loafers uh, like how do you keep that clean you know even though i'm not going out much it only takes one step in a puddle for those to go um south quick so i think this is the perfect color okay so let me try them on and see how we do All right, so I'm back from the try-on, and what can I say? When I walk, my heels really slide out of them, and they kind of, now that I'm looking at them, I don't know if you'll be able to see, but they do have this little bit of a shape here that goes out like that, so I think that's just the design of the shoe. Uh, so I guess I'm undecided about whether I will keep these or not for now. I'm gonna wear them around a little bit more maybe you know 10 minutes walk to the kitchen and back or something and see how they go they are super comfortable and super cozy and definitely i love the look of them so those are the pluses but i'm not sure how i feel about the heel sliding out um i think what i'll do is try them on with socks see if that helps and if that doesn't help then I'll probably just be returning them because, you know, like I say, these are almost um, $400, so it's not like they were free. It was a pretty good discount, so if they worked out, it would be amazing, um, but if they don't work out, they just don't work out. So, yeah, I guess that's, that's it. TBD. But I did want to do the unboxing and share my experience purchasing um, Gucci from DSW. So that's pretty much it. That's all I have. So now that I've already done the reveal and you know it's Gucci, the person who um, put me on to the fact that you can sometimes get Gucci at DSW is Will McKayson. Check out his video and his unboxing of his Gucci item from DSW and, and his other content too. It's super fun and um, entertaining and cool. So that's, uh, that's where I got inspired to buy these. But that's it for me for now. Let me know your thoughts. Uh, take care and Savannah. Peace.